All right, hey everybody, Kyle over with Weller Racing. I uh, just wanted to go over a little bit with the data logging on the Power Vision here. I uh, get quite a few questions. Uh, it might help simplify as far as what we're looking for, especially if it comes to when we're doing custom tuning. It could be naturally aspirated, turbocharged, uh, any one of those where we need to data log and send the files off. Um, so when you've got the screen plugged into your machine, uh, you're gonna fire up, you'll have your main screen. When the car's running, uh, a lot of times we'll want to get logs. For me, I like to get them in idle. So from the base initial files that we send to you, go and run the car at idle from a cold start up to when the cooling fans kick on. Once the fans kick on, uh, we can stop the log. Uh, starting and stopping the log is with this button right here. So you hit it once, there's gonna be a timer. It starts counting and we're ready to stop the log we're going to hit that button again right here, and that'll stop it. Um, so, like I say, when we're doing our custom tuning, I like to see uh, my initial files are really just that idle log from a cold start up to when the fans kick on, and then the get the files over to us so we can check them, make sure they're all good, and then if we need to make revisions, we'll do it right there. We'll send you the updated files to upload and then flash to your machine or we'll move on to where I'd like to get pulls from like a, a rolling second gear, third gear, fourth gear, uh, start and stop in each gear, but from a rolling start in second up to, you know, say 30, 40% throttle, just a nice linear throttle increase, uh, starting and stopping the log at the beginning and the end, and then shifting into say third gear, same thing, we'll start the log, run it up to that you know 30 40 percent and then stop it and the same thing in four uh, once we get done with that send the files over to us we'll go through them again if we need to make updates or changes we'll do all that we want to get that cleaned up before we start getting into our wide open and our our full throttle pulls stuff like that so um, once we get to that it really is easiest for us if we can get some third fourth and fifth gear full throttle pulls so it would be the same thing when we're rolling into third and then full throttle starting and stopping in each gear um, so once that's done I get out of here and we've got the logs saved in the device we're going to want to come over and plug the device in using the USB cable from the power vision to our computer and once we do that we should get the dialog to either pop up uh, or you can pull it up but we want to find that power vision there's going to be a folder inside labeled log files. Inside this folder is going to be those files that we just took and stored. Uh, these files are going to be the ones we can drag and drop them into an email, copy and paste, attach them, whatever it is. At that point, um, it, it just allows us to get them here, go over them, and then send you back updated revision tuning files if that might be or at least as far as moving forward so i uh, hope that helps clear up some of the things related to the data logging and and whatnot there but thanks again